turn. Uh, Phone call. Yep. Um, skip me. I'll probably just be healing him. I have to. I have my phone's ringing. Ah, okay. Okay. Uh, then I keep, you know, spamming a dual wielding attack. Yeah, so we can roll your attacks once again, and when uh, Zach goes comes back, he will like roll for damage, mm. like to for heal. Uh, Fifty-four. That's what happens. Yeah. Mm. From this free to hit. So I'm back. Okay. Yeah. So I can just take my turn after him. Yeah, mm -hmm. okay. No, no, that's wrong, that's wrong, that's wrong. Actually, it's it's actually plus five, so... Uh, I think the, I think the first one... Uh, the 19, like 34, it hits. The 30, it won't. You need 33 or higher. Yeah, then it wouldn't hit so any you way, have... so yeah. Three attacks that mm -hmm. hit? Yeah, three attacks that hit. Yeah. Okay, uh, hit roll chan. Medium damage damage, two gold wheel. There we go. Is he dead yet? Not yet. Uh, 72. 105 damage. I mean, don't you, like, 105 from what? I mean, ah, you are using something that doubles your damage? No, you're just attacking. I should be using the thing that doubles my damage. I attacked twice, didn't I? Hit twice. I mean, I... Ah, ah, sorry, because from it uh, cut your thingy, so I thought you only rolled twice, not thrice. Okay, so sorry, mm. didn't see that. Okay, so minus 105, and guess what? He's still alive. How much? Uh, okay. Below, Below 50 HP. Mm, okay. But he's looking very burned, bloodied, and what generally that? pissed. Mm. Yeah. And how are you looking, Odorous? Well, I'm, you know, kind of beaten up, healed, beaten up, healed, beaten up, healed. <laughs> yeah, what is, like what is, how close are you to dying currently? Uh, I'm pretty. I'm 63 health, so I'll die if he gets a full round attack on me. Mm. Okay. All right. Between me and Ramus, I think we can probably kill him. Yeah, but after he gets his turn after Ramus. Oh, yeah. Okay, Which I'm dead. So I'm gonna go for it. Oh dear. I'm casting you're, a spell. You're gonna kill steal me. You're all dead, you Shit. fools. My spell fails. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, so also, I'll like, just heal him as a swift action. Thank you. No, uh, but you can only heal him on your turn. Yeah, but he, you turn. know, we skipped his turn, no, so skip. he could do ah, it yeah. afterwards. Sorry, sorry. sorry. Okay, so you roll, can roll to how much do you heal him? Uh, yeah, sadly, much, sadly, like her spell fails, and this time the burning thingy, scorching ray, doesn't work, mm -hmm. and he gets a full mm. attack. And the big yes, Die. scorch as a is turning it bacon. I mean, he's still alive. Like the. Mm. She didn't overcome mm. his spell resistance. I'm saying don't die. That's bite, that's one claw, that's second. So even with power attack, they all hit. Mm. So bite. Uh, 3d8 plus 13 plus 6. Mm. So that's bite. That's one claw, that's second. Uh, 50, 52, 7, 80. Did he just do 80 damage? Uh, 52, 70, 80. Yeah, I think yeah, so. 80 on the dot. Yep. He's still alive? Yeah. I have six health remaining. Okay. Had you and, not healed me, I'd be dead. And I forgot, as a free action, his uh, unholy nimbus thingy opens up. Oh, yeah. So, you two are definitely in range. Uh, Genkiro, have you moved closer? Yes, yeah, you did. moved closer. Yeah. So, Genkiro, you also are in range. 23. 24. Ah, 22 are better. We'll save. Uh, 22 what? You need to make we'll a save. wheel save. Wheel save. Alright. You have uh, quite high wheel save, Zach. I have a belt of resistance, remember? Ah, that explains it. Had I had that thing, I would beat every will say, every save. I mean, uh, 
I more needed it for my uh, seventy. Damn it. For my reflex and fortitude saves than my will save. Okay, mm. so Genkiro, you are dazed for five rounds. It won't much right. matter much because he probably dies this turn, mm -hmm. this round. Yeah, because like for now, for five rounds, you will be haunted by visions of madness. Mm -hmm. Maybe probably something related to your like uh, destruction of your yeah. village or something like that. Yeah, nasty stuff. Uh, so yeah, you lose this turn, Mari. Um, kill some fuckers. Or yeah. one fucker in particular. Yeah. Uh, I use Cure Serious Wounds as a... Swift. Swift action, yes. Because I'm out of fourth level spells for my for spontaneous casting. Mm -hmm. You spontaneously come cast. And then I use Breath of Life for my standard action. Cool. I think no. Is it is it five d six or is it five d eight? I need I need to check that. Yeah, do that. It's five d eight. My bad. Mm. So yeah, roll five d eight. Yeah. yeah, better. Sixty two. Sixty yeah. two held heal. Now remember, mm. if he kills you, I can bring you back to the next round. Yeah, and then I'll and kill since him. Since I go before you, that means you can then hit him. Yeah. Hopefully. Yeah. But still, it's your turn, so it's high chance that you will. Yeah. Just as, as precaution, I use lay on hands on myself. Then I start hitting him once more. Chinese uh, might. Oh, hey, I could have casted Bone Shatter on the guy. <laughs> 41, 40, 29, uh, 41 and 40, so two hits for now. Did they hit? Uh, and overall, one, two, three hits. Mm, three hits. Mini damage, my, mini damage, I need to do a wheel, there we go. He had 38 HP left. <laughs> okay, I think I kind of skewered him. Oh dear. Yeah, all of you can see, like, um, not his trusted lance, but uh, his spear, like, finds a way and plunges into the beef of the demon and, like, takes a nice chunk of him, like, skewers him directly through his dark, corrupted heart and, like, just mm. makes a shish kebab out of him. Mm. I hope I don't get spewed in blood. No. I hide behind Odoros. Indeed, so all the blood and, and Otiro, and Otiro's gaze, a uh, face full of like there is like a blah, blast mm. of blood and intestines mm. and all of that stuff. By now, I don't even flinch an eye. I'm so used to it. Mm. <laughs> okay. Oh so dear. He dies. Like turns the rain to Zack. Do you have any water spells? Because this is fucking disgusting. I cast create water and make uh, ten gallons of water just appear bo above Odoros. <laughs> like washes me clean. Or just like a very quick shower. Yeah, that pretty much. Dissipates the smell. Mm. I do it again because it's a can uh, it's a origin or whatever. Mm. Serious level spell. Yeah, yeah, I know, but uh, wait unless uh, some very powerful. War, uh, air, uh, water elementals count like, hey, yo, mm. stop taking our water. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Anyways, yeah, like, um, you first shower me, I'm like, tag, then you shower me again while I'm just trying to say it, like, god damn it. Okay, mm. so. As you you shouldn't say, god damn it, you're a paladin. Mm. Mm. By the gods. Basically, mm. there is some room that I don't really right now have a good description to it. Basically, What's something it like an um, astrology room. Like, you know, oh. Kind of like a planetarium. Planetarium, master, like planetarium maps. Poten well, potential I'd, I'd say, mm -hmm. I'm, if the it's next to the planet shifting, it's probably a planescape thing. Yeah, that'd be cool. Mm, we like, see. oh, here are the planes. Mm -hmm. Maybe. And also, as you move toward the room, this time the radiation is even stronger. So. Everyone will, will need to make a uh, fortitution save. Oh, 
shit. Poor dude was. Well, was it out of level four spells, I could use neutralize poison. Mm. This is my fifth fifth one this session. Well, you're not alone. Okay, mm -hmm. so seventeen seventeen. I need to roll for Ramus, and her fortitude is. Uh... Oh, she gets plus four versus poison. Technically, it is poison, so she gets plus nineteen overall. Yeah, explosive decompression isn't all. Like you don't actually explode if you're in a vacuum. Nice. No, okay. you don't. You get slow, Mari, no bigger. Mari and Ramis pass now. Otiros and Genkiro, because because you are at this epicenter of the radiation. I will describe what the source looks like in a moment. Does the, it happen immediately? Uh, yeah, it's a like, primary. Does it affect them? No, does it like affect them immediately? Uh, radiation. Radiation, radiation initially deals constitution drain unless the exposed character succeeds at a fortitude saving throw, okay. and it's at it, and it's at my discretion uh, when like the cons the constitution drain happens immediately. The other stuff like secondary after some time. Alright, I was just later. gonna say because I could like remove, I could remove sickness for now and just like. Gets rid of it for a bit, maybe. Okay, so yeah. Otiros and Genkiro, this is a constitution drain, and mm -hmm. it's that much. Four D six constitution drain. It's a severe radiation. Tomorrow, <laughs> yes, indeed, I am down at one constitution. Wait, yeah. seventeen. I'm at negative one constitution. You're dead. <laughs> yeah, and I'm standing there shaking. The <laughs> mm, yeah. Ouch. I mean, I might not even like it. Doesn't it didn't happen because you were as you were fighting and moving like closer and closer. So even if you were in range of a uh, less extreme uh, radiation, you were soaking it up. Mm. And with time, yeah. like yeah, so does this have, like. Suddenly you feel like, um, Otiros, you feel like very weakened, I guess. Yeah, I can barely stand, uh, pretty much. And basically you see like immediately like uh, uh, Genkiro falls mm -hmm. face down, fall flat. But I guess, it... but I guess, no wait. <laughs> he crumples into a heap. That's what happens when you lose your constitution. He, oh, he just like, oh, Not really. I would assume since it's radiation, he just like starts puking up his internal organs. Yeah, something mm -hmm. like that. And dies. <laughs> you, you you see his heart on the floor. Yes. You see I him always do out of his heart. eyes, his ears. Uh, he's coughing up blood. He's. Uh, I, don't, I don't need magic to tell that that guy's dying. Yeah, and Saki is completely okay right. despite being right beside him. Like yeah. yeah. So because because uh, Ramus is his wife or something like that. So she, she immediately sees that something's going wrong, and she uses her one of her innate racial spells called Neutralize Poison. Oh, come on. Mm. Awesome. I could have used that, but I used all of my level 4 spells. Save but still, like, you are not dead game hero, but still I'm going to say because more or less you failed to save, uh, you are weakened, so you still lose, lost some uh, constitution. Mm. Right. I'd say just put about one, like, Odoroses or something. Yeah, because she did that at last moment to yeah. save you. I stabilized due to pure willpower and nobody tries to help me or anything. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, and <laughs> yeah, see so that. am I... You are you are, you are barely, I pat you on the shoulder and be like, you'll be fine. You are barely tomorrow. conscious <laughs> and... I just fall down because I can't take it. <laughs> I mean, you are, you are somewhat conscious and like Ramus like holds you up. And basically the source of this, the crack, rift or something like that in the astrology room is not large enough to fit through, but large enough so that radiation from the void empty space might get through the crack through the mm. crack get inside do i see anything through the crack mm. you see horrifying no, just images of madness dark Take a dark space of the void of the of the cosmos but as you're looking for something you know what you can you can give me a perception check 
it won't necessarily deal with the crack itself. Mm -hmm. Oh shit, no, he said he is plus 30. So I'm gonna... See, we can't find anyone who's sneaking anymore. Uh, <laughs> so... <laughs> but it gave some light sources. Ooh. I'm gonna give him like penalty because of all that some, because of some shit. So he will get only that. I see him. Yeah. Okay. Uh, like somewhere near the ceiling, you spot a like a silhouette spider. of a thing, kind of humanoid thing, probably. That's. Like very clearly, it like waits to ambush. It's like in position to basically <laughs> go and attack. And well, yeah, you see that. For example, he has uh, his uh, two-legged creature, like his quad, not bipedal creature. Quadruple. Uh, bipedal creature, and he has four arms. Interesting. And yes. he he looks very ripped, and like your intuition as an adventure tells you that he will be extremely dangerous as a, a melee combatant. Yes, I'm just shaking here. And Let's so see. I don't want to fight that guy, because he will most likely die a horrible death. Yes, neither do I. Please get me out of here. Um, I suggest running. Right now, I, yeah. mm -hmm. I could probably take him. Really? Yeah. Mm. Yeah, well, it's um, like he might not do exactly First, the same. First, I cast same. mending on that rift and close it. Okay. Yeah. But before you start running, I will give him a benefit of the doubt, meaning that. I mean, it's it's your call if you want to keep your current initiative checks or for this situation roll again. To maybe have better because he has nice initiative. I have a plus three. If I re-roll, it's most likely going to be lower. Yeah. Okay. That's probably true. I, have I also have a plus three, so it should technically be higher. But I don't want to. Re I, can, I might as well. Here we go. I mean, I have no. I mean, you don't need to if you don't want to re-roll. Re I no. might. There um, you go. Much better. Okay. Mm. Twenty-three. Much better. So he gets. 20 plus 11. Okay, so 23, 16. Wait, so describe like who takes whom and how do you run? Um, I'm not running. I oh, hope you. Ramus isn't running. I suggest those two book it since they would most likely get their asses handed to them mm -hmm. immediately. Alright, so. Mm -hmm. Odros, you and me booking it. No. Seems like a good idea. On your before turn, I, I guess. Before I cough up any more lungs. Mm. You only got two after all. Okay. Let's leave this to the ladies. Um, then we is run. there a check I can use to figure out what the hell he is? Sure. What kind of check would it be? Knowledge, arcana, knowledge planes. Probably arcana because you already did it. Would religion there. work? Uh, Religion mm. works for demons and whatnot. He's not a demon. So, devil's Play demon. So it could have worked for that one guy, but he's not a demon. He might look I have at the planes. It. I have nature. Okay, because right now you see him. I can give you another planes check. Okay. I rolled a one. Really? <laughs> yeah. You, you have I no fucking idea what that thing is. You know that it's dangerous. Yeah, I got that much. And like really, really strong. Yeah, I figured that much. And also, because you saw him, like you see that he doesn't have any armor on him. You know, any not typical armor, but his skin, something like a scales or something like that, looks incredibly hard. So he also has very, yeah. very high AC. Yeah, I was wanting to learn something else, but. Okay, so, so Ramus just shouts to the guys like, "We'll, I'll cover you, like, mainly to Genkiro. 
and mm. question is if does she have anything that can hurt him it might be something like that now they were at the entrance to the room so they should be able to get out quickly while I'm like up by the rift so I mean, he'll probably go after me yes he probably will and hopefully he doesn't kill me but <laughs> Oh well, if he does, I'll yeah. just be back tomorrow. Yeah, that, that, that's plus of your character. Uh, yeah. Okay, so now the question, what she can do to him? Uh, she might do... Okay, uh, so maybe it will work better, so for now she casts, uh, she casts something and mainly Mari, you see that suddenly she disappears. It probably is invisibility spell. Yep. So that's her turn. Damn uh, it. Genkiro, you are booking it. Yep. Okay, now it's time for, as I nicknamed him, the Shredder. Uh, Four-round guy. I'm gonna say that, yes, you managed to mend the crack and close it off. And he's like, uh, yeah, he will be in range to get to you and... To get to you, and I think he will, uh, with uh, two of his claws, he will make a grapple check. Okay. Now I need to check what's his uh, to grapple. And of course, I took fits for him to for grapple. Of course. Plus for this. And yes, that's the most dangerous thing that I prepared on this floor. I figured. Really? <laughs> I need to... F that misses. I... Yeah, I guess he... Natural ones work on combat maneuvers. Yeah, yeah, he do I'm just looking that he doesn't get any rerolls. He doesn't have something like that. No, there isn't anything that does that. Uh, if he has greater grapple, it's nice because he can do it as a move action. Yeah, Which he, means that... Yeah, he has greater grapple. But if he wasn't next to me, he had to move to me to get to me. Yeah, so he moved next to you, he tried to catch you, but even though we are technically speaking old hack, you managed to dodge. Yep. Okay, Otiros is... as it looks. Otiros is also booking it. Mm, I have absolutely nothing I can do otherwise. Yeah, you have one, no, one constitution, so you feel very weak and whatnot. I have like 10 HP. Yeah, something like that. And Mari, so this guy is right next to you. Does it look like he has reach? Uh, well, he's large. Also, as he's closer, so you can f like f get the but, feeling. Like, what did he get? Did he uh, get in range of me or next to me to grab for me? Do you have a reach? No. I mean, but like he could have technically grappled me from ten feet away. Yeah, probably something like that, because most of his natural attacks, like Claw, Bite, Slam mm -hmm. attack, have 10 feet reach. Uh, his Tail Slap and Sting attacks are 15 foot reach. Alright, well... And of course he has a Gore. Like, Gore, I think it's like a, he has a, something like a Horns. So this guy's really nasty crap. Anyways, so... He. I'll still be in range of those. I won't be in range of his nastiest. Mm -hmm. stuff. A five foot step back and I'm casting a spell on him. Not casting defensively so he can take his attack of opportunity. Uh, if he, he wants to. He will take them. But I'm only in range of what is yeah. apparently the tail slap and the sting. Yeah, I need to see because he can make only one attack. I mean, technically speaking, like, sting is on his tail, so I don't know if he... Like, if you only de get damage from Tail Stop or Sting if he hits you. Also It'd be one of the other, because it's only one attack. Ah, okay, yeah, because he doesn't get... Yeah, I didn't give him the thing to... But I still think, like, he's able to use Greater Vital Strike, because he's making... When you... No, wait, uh, attack of action. Course he is. You can oh, make oh, one... Yeah. Uh, no, 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 wait, okay. I will leave that on his attack action. Or maybe? Wait. No, it, Vital Strike is a standard action. 
when you use uh, the attack action, you can make one attack at your highest base attack mm -hmm. bonus that this additional damage. Technically mm -hmm. speaking, it's attack. But it's not an attack action. Okay, fair enough. Yep. Okay, so... I'd be saying the same if one of us had vital, vital strike. Yeah, no problem. Okay, so... You have low AC, so unless he rolls a 1, he will hit you. Yeah, my AC is... 18. He hits you, no problem. That's not a 1. As, as, as I say, like, unless he rolls a 1, he will hit yep. you. So that he will hit you with his sting. And that's the total damage from the sting. Okay. Do you just do any saves from poison or anything? No, it's not poisonous, thankfully. Okay. I wasn't sure. Also, yeah. So from, uh, this doesn't work on sting, but um, like you see that from his the tip of his fingers and claws, you see something like a almost AC dripping. Fun. Okay. Elemental attack. Um, something like that. And yeah, it's okay. So. He hit you, so that's the question, what does it do with your spell? Uh, nothing. He just gets to hit me. If I was casting defensively, I'd have to make a concentration check, and he wouldn't get an attack of opportunity, okay. but if I failed, Th failed speaking, the check, I want to get the spell. Yeah, technically speaking, I remember there was something like, if you get injured while casting, then it also forces you to make a concentration, but whatever. I'm not sure. Okay. And, uh... Anyways, I'm using Bill for Polymorph on him. So he gets a Fortitude save at... Yeah, it's a Concentration Check DC Injured while casting 10, plus Damage oh. Dealt, plus Spell Level. Oh, shit. You can check it What's on... the... Huh? Yeah, I believe you. That sucks. I wish I knew that. I also would have cast it defensively. Uh, you can you can do that. If you All right, know, that's... I guess you would know about that, so you can cast defensively yeah. and that that's damage doesn't That's a lot easier. Go. Yeah. Because that's just 10 plus the spell level. That's, that's why I was slightly surprised that you went for, yeah. for him to attack. And so then, so I have to hit 10 plus the spell level, which would be... Five, so fifteen. So yeah, I think I make it. Okay. And now we bail for polymorph, and he gets some sort of uh... a twenty-two DC fortitude save. Uh, mm. you know what? You just made a spell that he—that's his best saving throw. I I figured it was, but I needed to try something. That's quick. his fortitude. Oh shit. What the fuck am I fighting? No, oh, that's Ross. my yeah. I guess it's Ramus's turn. Um. Okay. <sighs> okay. How does sound like acid pit? Sounds like. No wait, he can fly. Huh? You don't see wings, but like he seems like a. He looks like he would be able to fly. Uh, fuck, what, what the fuck am I fighting? See? High leveled, unfettered Eidolon. Oh shit. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's the question. Like, wait, does, it, does she have banishment as an innate spell? Because technically speaking, he's an outsider. Yeah. They can be banished. Uh, That's the good news, I think. Holy Ward won't work because he would be only be deafened, even if he fails. Uh, so either she thinks like either it would be uh, Holy Smite, which might deal some sort of damage to him, or just go with... Uh, or just go with uh, maybe Scorching Ray. Oh. Yeah, because he doesn't have spell resistance, that's one plus. Either with Scorching Ray or Fireball. Well, the good news is, is that I'm most likely going 
to die as soon as he full attacks me, so... Like a flame strike or chain of lightning. I mean, okay, because he doesn't have a wings, he has magical flight, so... Because I don't want to be too meta, so she will cast uh, Acid Pit on him. What is it? Acid Pit, like uh, 10 by 10 hole. It, he fits oh. in that, 60 okay. feet deep. Oh, acids. Acid, acid, acid on bottom. Too bad he has resistance 5 to acid, but... But he might drop. Okay, reflex plus 15. Okay, so he didn't kind of expect that, so he's kind of surprised, and he didn't activate his magical flank in time, so he uh, drops down. Now I need to read what's the damage for that. Is it Pete? Uh, and we need to kill this guy, or else he's gonna follow us and kill us all. Hmm. So. 60 feet deep. Uh, I need per... to give those guys time to run away. Okay, 2d6 acid. Which he takes only. Okay, so he doesn't take any damage from acid because resistance 5. And he, he if he falls 60 feet, how much damage of falling damage is that? 5d6. Okay, and aside from that, he doesn't have any damage resistance, I think. Uh, uh, yeah, he doesn't have damage resistance. Okay. 13. Okay, uh, Genkiro is, I guess, still booking it. Yep. Okay, mm, it's his turn. He falls 60 feet to the ground, like in the extra dimensional pit. Uh, he can fly, so he will activate that, but his fly is only 30 feet. So he will take two move actions, like to. Like, he, he, right now he's activated his flying, so he appears uh, next to Mari once again, but he doesn't get an attack. Oh, I think, would it be...